Gotta like the top two lines and some just great matchups. And this has been such a tight series. You know, game five is gonna be a great one as well. Being limited to just eight minutes and 37 seconds in game number four, still chipped in three more block shots. And spun around with Jason Robertson. Here's Tanev leading Dallas in. Here's the first stop of the game for Skinner. Now Haskinen will take over for Dallas. Nero Haskinen has blocked more ice time than anybody in this series. And works his way in. Look, short side there. And it was stopped by Skinner. And McDavid will wind it up. But now it's Bouchard giving it back to 97. In with pace. And a shot on that here that was steered aside. Bouchard moves up. And back to McDavid. And it almost pays off. Big hit there by Hyman. As he nailed Sam Steele, and here's McDavid back to the line, and a blocker stopped by Ottinger off Darnell Nurse. Here's another chance, and Kulak stopped by Ottinger. On the floor check, Vander Kane has the puck again and hooks the backhand just wide. Here's Dylan Holloway. Back is Kulak right on, and that will stick to Ottinger. Take charge of the game in the second period. That was flipped in front, chopped away. Sagan sweeps it across. There's Rope hits a back hit. They stop rebound. And that is denied. Oh, what a chance for Dallas to open the scoring. And Stuart Skinner stands tall. Hits had one of those chances. Here's Robertson going to the front again. Still loose in front. Skinner's down. And it's pulled away from the front of the net. And Dry Saddle will get it out of harm's way. Stars with a couple of great A's, but now back up Perry. And across it goes, McLeod just missed. The try center driving the net. Look to center, it comes back. A Bouchard bomb doesn't get to the net. Centered in front. As try center one time to center and pass, it's still not over. Tanev back under seven and a half to go here in the first. And a little room here. Havelski, and he set that just wide. Here's Bouchard after the face-off win. Nugent Hopkins missed the target. Dreisaitl kicks it back to Bouchard. Steal and delay here the penalty killers for Dallas. Dreisaitl for McDavid to Bouchard. Ribbon drop, scores! Ryan Nugent Hopkins has the kickstarter in game five. Seen a lot of in the last little while from this power play was just the straight setup for the bomb from Evan Bouchard. Quick rotation there, and it's right through the traffic. Hits Tanev in front, and it pops right over. You just never know what's going to happen with the chaos of a hard shot. Ottinger. Back and he got positive reviews from the coach after his. Stanley Cup playoff debut, that one. And he'll hit the bench on a change as he's going to place it back. Out comes Connor Brown, in comes Logan Stankoven. And Skinner gets a piece of that. It's easy clear. That's a feeling of a very big, important period in this series, doesn't it? Well, 100%. And you really felt it from the crowd. I, I thought they were a little timid and nervous. And a good season for the Oilers, but a quick clear here for Dallas. And the usual compliment out to start. And a lead feed to Dry Settle to take them in. Nugent Hopkins to the net. Scores! He's doubled down. Back to back. Power play goals. And Edmonton leads two to nothing. Team a two goal lead. A long stretch pass, a very different breakout. No drop back there. One pass later across from Leon Dreisaitl. And this is just a beauty of a shot. Nugent Hopkins gets it settled underneath the glove. Change that perspective. Three of the first four games have seen a two goal lead disappear. Here comes Dallas. A loose puck in front of Darnell Nurse. Finds it and sends it a hit to Keane. And here's the Don on and once again he was cherry picking at the Edmonton line. We've seen that in every game, haven't we? Yan marks in. He'll drop it off. Carter Brown shot. Blockered away there by Ottinger. And Jamie Ben will take over. Up ahead it goes to Haskin and in the box as the Oilers scored. 
And that one will breathe. Evander Kane to take this face off. Up against Joe Pavelski. Wins it in the offense. It's a proper has scored! Philip Broberg from the point! His first Stanley Cup playoff goal. He came close minutes earlier, and now it's a 3 0. The momentum changes with another big goal, but it's also who gets it. Right through a beautiful screen. Duchesne gets right by his lane. Ottinger doesn't even really react. Late up and over the glove. There's another great sound as it hits the post and goes in, and Broberg with that kind of a freedom. And he's the kind of guy that has the skill set and the speed and the skating to be able to do just that. There's a turnover and Sagan with a weak backhand and Eckholm and at center on the tape for McDavid with Nugent Hopkins. Ryan Nugent Hopkins with three two-goal postseason games in front. And McDavid not able to come up with that. That off the star and back out. Okay, Hintz will head to the bench, but David will fly back in. He spots Hyman working, has barely in, and a club stop by Ottinger on a power move by Zach Hyman. A lefty in the defenseman, so your stick is a little bit vulnerable to the outside, and so why not take it? Perry gets it through, the cloud kicks it back. Nurse at the line, Rick wide, and it comes to Eckholm. And that shot right on, looking for a rebound was Perry in front. And Dallas clears. Through for Pavelski, and he'll send it in and gets a change. Sam Steele with a quick pivot in the zone, and Haskin in shot. Wide of the mark, kept in by Suter. And Rick starts back. He'll flip it high off the end glass, all the way there first. Holloway feeds it back. Easy pickings for Ottinger, and he holds on. But the Stars are going to have to offer a comeback either tonight or as the series progresses here because right now the Oilers in pretty good shape. Now. And stop there by Skinner up in. Well, they're 0 for 10 in their last five, 0 for 9 in this series and a chance to try to get something going. It is the longest drug of the playoff for them, and that would hit Skinner and Heal. Jimmy Ben into the skates of Robertson. He's going it again. Robertson down low, booked it. Skinner across. Robin Johnson with a huge stop. But here's the great down low to the little bumper spot and the shot by Johnston. Desperate times clearly here with the Stars down three and 20 minutes to go, Chris. Oh, here we go. Eight straight goals for Edmonton. And protecting a three-goal lead in game five on the road. Here's Hyman trying to come out in front. And on here. I'm thinking he might be able to make a pass, but you could see a little bit of chaos in front as Johnston goes one way. Lindell went right after McDavid. His shot is off the stick to dry settle. Back for Stan Coben. He'll send it in behind the net. Ben there watched by Kulak. Here's why gets in front. Big stop by Stuart Skinner. Another words for each other. Well, oh, remember the one that Stan Coven didn't shoot earlier and there's one he did. Right trying to go off the post and in and Stuart Skinner read where the pass was going. Watch that little extra toe. Petrovic. Up ahead it goes looking for Dodonov. With Duchesne and Marchman again. And it's worked for the foot to shade. Stop! Another big one by Skinner. Get the feeling if any line for Dallas is going to get a comeback kick started, it's this one. Ben out there with the kids. Stank over to the line. That shot scores! Carly took it. Tipped in front. It's Lyon Johnson again. Goes to the net hard. Keeps the play alive here. And then Jamie Ben a little kick to Stan Coven and Harley makes sure this one gets through but how about that tip he turned his stick upside down watch the blade of number 53 he turns it around and is able to chip it up that's almost an impossible play and because Sunday the Edmonton Oilers are going to get a chance to reserve their ticket to the Stanley Cup final they've won game five three to one
Dreisaitl is flanked by Ryan.